Our Prophet Sallallahu said, I promise a house in the middle of Jannah. I promise a house dead center in Jannah. Listen to this. For the one who avoids argument even when he's upon the haqq. You have the haqq, but he just gives it up. Just don't argue. You have the haqq, but you just give it up. You don't argue. Our Prophet Sallallahu said, I promise that person a house in the middle of Jannah, the Wasat al Jannah, which means simple example somebody comes and makes fun of you. The Haqq is with you, nobody should make fun of you. You have the right to say something, to defend. You have the right to defend. But you say, you know what? This person is a Khatabahum al Jahilun, he's a Jahil. My job, Salam, let it be. You eliminate your ego, you shut your. You're, 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 you control your anger, you don't say anything vulgar, and you stop arguing. Let it be. Which leads us to the other point directly related to all of this. Of the easy ways to dissipate anger, to not have the consequences of anger, is you don't open your mouth. You see, here's the beauty. If anger remains inside of you, even if I know it's there, it won't irritate me. I can see it, it might even amuse me. The minute you open your mouth and you express that anger verbally, khalas, all hope is gone. Correct? If you notice anger in somebody, what are you going to do? Okay, you're angry. But as long as that anger is controlled within, and that's why our Prophet said, hadith is authentic. When one of you gets angry, be quiet. What a simple hadith. When one of you gets angry, be quiet. Do not speak in a state of anger and you will automatically eliminate 99% of the harm of the anger. Subhanallah, it's amazing. Anger inside of you is forgiven by Allah and forgiven by mankind. Allah never says in the Quran, don't get angry. Rather, Allah says, praising the believers, الغيظ, Those who control, who conceal their anger, the, 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 the benefit or the blessing or the high status is not in the one who never gets angry. Frankly, it's beyond my control, your control to get angry. The high status is the one who conceals the anger. The one who covers up the anger. How do you cover up the anger? You don't express it. Simple as that. This means the other person might know that you have the anger, but you simply don't express it. In the famous hadith of Tabuk, the incident of Tabuk, when the three companions who stayed behind, when they stayed behind, and they didn't have an excuse, you know the story, the famous one. And they came to the Prophet ﷺ finally to make an excuse. And the first one, the one who narrates the whole story, he comes back and he said, I was embarrassed, but I presented myself to the Prophet ﷺ. And he smiled, listen to this phrase, the way that he would smile when he is angry. Means he knew the Prophet ﷺ was angry. Means they could recognize when he was angry. But it also means when he was angry, he would cover his own anger with a smile. Look at that. And they recognized the smile that he had when he is angry. He smiled at me the way that he would smile when he is angry. In other words, when we get angry, we frown. Our thing. When the Prophet got angry, he had a special smile. Trying to cover that up. The Sahaba, they knew him so well, they knew this is the smile of when he's angry. That's his akhlaq, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Even in his anger, he would smile. The one who conceals the anger does not bring it out. So this is of the best ways to control the anger and to not show the evil effects. And that is to not speak, to calm down. And by the way, typing on a computer... Responding to an email is exactly the same as speaking. Do not write an email when you are angry, brothers and sisters. Never, ever compose an email or write something or a text message or a WhatsApp message when you are angry. Calm down. Relax. Follow the advice of our Prophet wasallam, And that is to say, A'udhu Billahi min shaitan rajim to do wudu if your anger is immense. If you're standing, sit down. If you're sitting, lie down. Do not speak or write or type or answer a message in a state of anger.